Did you know that acid reflux can cause a chronic cough? They say 25% of chronic coughs can be caused by acid reflux. So it's either acid or non-acidic contents come up the, the feeding tube and then it goes into your larynx or bronchial tube and it makes you cough. So a chronic cough is defined as a cough that lasts more than eight weeks. So what kind of points you in the direction of acid reflux causing the cough? Cough is worse at night or after a meal. Coughing that occurs while you're lying down. Another is if you're not on any medications that would cause a cough such as ACE inhibitors or you're not a smoker. How about if your chest x-ray is clear and there's no infection that's going on? You don't feel post-nasal drip drip dripping down the back of your throat that's causing a cough or you don't have asthma. Those are other reasons that you might have to think it's acid reflux. So how do we find out if the cough is acid related? Perhaps we can do an EGD. That's where they put the scope down into your stomach. The other thing is sometimes if you don't have alarm signs like you're not losing weight, food's not getting stuck in your throat or down in the middle of your chest, we may just start you on a medication such as a PPI, a proton pump inhibitor, which decreases the amount of acid you make. So you may have heard of these, Prilosec, Omeprazole, Nexium, Prevacid. You try those. If after six to eight weeks on the medication, your symptoms have completely resolved, it's pretty good news. Kind of makes you think that it's probably acid reflux. If you're still having symptoms after six to eight weeks of being on the medication, please see your doctor as you may need further testing. You know, if you don't want to try medications, you could always try lifestyle changes to see if that eliminates your chronic cough. Perhaps avoid lying down like two, two and a half hours after meals. Try to lose weight. Don't smoke. Trying to decrease uh, foods that you know cause cough, such as spicy foods or tomato-based foods. Eating frequent smaller meals may help, and then raising the head of your bed up by six to eight inches may help. Not putting pillows, that doesn't really do it. You may actually have to raise the head of the bed up by putting some blocks underneath. Hopefully you don't slide down to the bottom. That's the issue.